Hi Treasureland, it is Melanie here with week three of our Prayers and Proverbs series. Now, before we get started, I want you guys to grab your Bibles and your notebooks and flip to today's lesson. Obviously, we're going to be in Proverbs, but specifically chapter three. Now, I want you all to give a very warm welcome to our special guest for today's lesson, Miss Sadie Weevil. Hi, Treasureland. I'm Sadie. Thanks for having me today. It is so good to be here with you. And aren't you guys jealous? We live together now so we can sit next to each other. We can even touch each other. Wow. And I'm so excited to hear what our passage is for today. So am I. Today we are reading Proverbs chapter 3 verses 5 and 6. It says, trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. Verse 6 says, seek his will in all you do, and he will show you which path to take. Whoa, that's a really, really that's important good. passage. <laughs> now, Sadie, when you think of trust, what's the first thing that pops into your head? Hmm, I would think about how I can trust my friends, I can trust my family, I can tell them things, I can ask them to do something and trust that they're going to do it because I know that they love me and that they're willing to do it for me. Whoa, that is a really good answer. I was thinking something a little more like this. Dress balls! <laughs> well, that was really fun. That was a lot of fun. Yep. But, you know, I'm not sure if when Solomon wrote this, he was really talking about trust falls. I think you're right. Do you guys even remember what he said about trust? Shout it out at home. Who did Solomon say we needed to trust? Pretty good answer. Sadie, what do you think? Yeah, you know, I think he said the Lord, right? I think, <laughs> I think so. I think that's what he said. Mm -hmm. And then what did God say he would do if we trusted him? You guys are right again. When we trust in the Lord and lean on our own understanding, He makes our paths right. straight. Our paths straight. Yes. Woo! Well, that was a really great passage about trust. Now, yeah. this week, you have a coloring sheet you can work on, but I also want you guys to find one thing you can trust God with. It could be a secret or, I mean, it could be anything that you want God to know. Yeah. Thank you so much, Sadie, for being here with us today. It was so great to have you. Of course. Thank you for having me. How fun. I know. Alrighty. <laughs> Thanks again, Sadie, so much for helping with our lesson today. Now, I am going to pray and close us out. Dear Jesus, I thank you so much for this week. I thank you for allowing us to trust you so, so much for leading us down the right paths. This week, I pray over each of our Treasureland kids and family that we would be finding new things to trust you with, that we would be careful and comfortable to share our secrets with you, and that we would want to tell you everything happening in our lives. I pray this all in Jesus' name. Amen. Thanks, guys. <laughs>